Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> if you may or may not notice, but there is no squiggle on this camera. Cleo has the exact same camera as me, and she brought it. And I was like, oh, can we borrow that for the entire Europe trip? So she's she's been kind enough to lend us her camera. So no more squiggle. <laughs> now we are just heading down to the train station, and we are making our way towards Edinburgh. And we're going to be spending a couple of nights there. Yeah, we're just kind of just logging our bags to the train station and then we have to catch two trains, one into the city and then one into Glasgow city and then one to Edinburgh city. So, uh, yeah, should be good. The houses here are so beautiful. I love that. Even the roads. Machine gave us all of the tickets. We have. Why do we need so many? We just need one. So we just got to Glasgow Central, where we'll be making our transfer, and it is a really beautiful uh, train station. All right, we just realized we're at the wrong train station. We just have to make a quick five minute walk to the next one and then we can jump on our train to Edinburgh. We can now say we went to Glasgow and Scotland and saw someone walk around the streets of the kilt. <laughs> I suppose it's kind of good we're doing this little walk. So we're showing you guys a bit more of Glasgow. So we kind of failed at that yesterday. <laughs> so beautiful. It's a Timmy's. Oh no, it's just a Horton's. <laughs> <laughs> How beautiful is the street? I know. These streets are really making me wish we stayed longer in Glasgow, but I know there's plenty of these type of streets when we explore Europe, so it's fine. It's okay. Do you think we found like the main like fashion district yeah, here? So what on the No, no, uh, down there. Yeah, it looks so beautiful. Hello. Hello. Checking in. Yeah. Thank you. So we just dropped our bags off. That hotel is absolutely beautiful. That building. So oh nice. my gosh. Edinburgh we'll give you, like, is so a full nice. Tour of the hotel once we check in because our room's yeah. ready in like half an hour. Yeah. We're going to head down now to a place called Old Town and you can see it from here. It looks amazing. Oh I have to show you guys. It's in I've never seen anything oh like no, it before. <laughs> so beautiful. Wow. Oh, we only stayed in Edinburgh for 2 days. I know. <laughs> much just put our stuff down and I have to admit this hotel is the best view of a hotel room I've ever stayed in don't you reckon that view is amazing I know ah oh, so beautiful 
This is what happens when we stay at really nice hotels, we get excited. But yeah, so we're staying here at the Balmoral. We have probably about three or four more hours left of daylight, so we're just gonna put our bags down and go and explore. Guys, the room's so pretty. There's our big bed, and then we got a little TV and some amazing views through these windows. And the bathroom, I think, is the best bit. It's a big marble bathroom. As you can see, it has a cute little plant, and yeah, marble bathroom with robes, which are our favorite thing, yay! And I think this looks really, really nice. Oh, someone just brought us little treats. <laughs> some mandarins and some shortbread. Oh, That's so cute. And the roads are so pretty. We've gone down this road called Cockburn Ave, and it's like it bends, and the road, uh, the buildings are so pretty. We're now going down the Royal Mile, which is like a street where they've blocked it off and no cars can go down. And I see the street performers and the buildings are just amazing. So cool. excited when we saw that castle in Toronto, the Castleoma Castle. Well, we've now just found a castle in Edinburgh. Called the Edinburgh Castle. And it, like, wow, it's a hundred times more incredible than the Castleoma Castle. Uh-huh, I think it's an actual proper castle Like this, castle. this is a castle castle. We'll just walk, walking down the road and then we found the Elephant House which is the cafe that JK Rowling wrote the first few books of Harry Potter in. It's and like where Harry Potter was made. Pretty much, it says on the front the birthplace of Harry Potter. There it is, pretty cool. We're pretty big Harry Potter fans. Let's go inside. So we've just come back, we wanted a quick coffee and we found out that we have an espresso machine. I've never used one of these before. Might as well come here instead of Starbucks. You want to make us a coffee? Yeah, do you want one? Yeah. That looks amazing. Yes. We need one of these in our life, Stephen. We need to travel with an espresso machine. Look at all our baggage now that it's up in the room. They just brought all our baggage up. Oh yeah, by the way, we just came back from Old Town. I'm not sure if we told you yeah, that. Yeah, I think we did. Oh, do you want your coffee? Yes, please. <sighs> I have to admit, my favorite part of the night, or the, the whole day, is when I get to jump into bed. Thanks so much for watching, guys. We are going on a Highlands tour tomorrow. A lot of you recommended that Scotland's like rural areas. I don't know if it's rural or not, but at least this areas outside of the main cities are beautiful. So, I'm really excited to see that tomorrow and yeah, it should be a good day. But thanks so much for watching guys and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Let go, you're just as bad as laying